Hey, what's going on? I'm Matthew from TheRightTrader.com here back today with another cryptocurrency price prediction analysis and forecast video. Today I'm going to be going over none other than BitConnect, which is one that was requested a couple times to me and is surprisingly popular in the cryptocurrency community. Now I'm going to get the elephant uh, in the room out of the way right from the start here and BitConnect is widely regarded as being a scam, right? Now, there is a lot of controversy around it, and people are a bit split around uh, surrounding the matter because some people claim that, you know, they've used it and they've benefited from it, they've profited from it uh, nicely, and others say that, you know, it's a complete scam and that it's bound to collapse, right? So I'm going to get into all of the, those things that concern the those allegations and sort of some of the red flags out there in just a second. And, you know, I'll go over the chart and everything, where I think it'll be heading in the next couple months. Now, let me just give a quick shout out to my price predictions uh, playlist. If you're interested in hearing any of my other price predictions and thoughts on other cryptocurrencies, I'll have a link to this playlist in the description in the comments below. So go check it out if you're interested in getting a second opinion on a cryptocurrency. And coming over back to BitConnect here. Now, let's start off with, you know, just their website in general, right? And as you can see, it's, it's not exactly the most professional website out there, right? It looks very, you know, basic and it's pretty self-explanatory. Now, where, where do the problems come in with BitConnect, right? Now, it isn't really my place to say if it's a scam or not, but I will point out that there are definitely, you know, a lot of red flags with this. And you really have to think when there's that, you know, so many allegations against it, people claiming that it's a scam, and, and the red flags and, and stuff like that, is it really even worth the risk anymore to, to invest in something like this, right? I think, I think that's a, an important question to ask. And even though I think that the price might increase in the short term, we don't know when this thing could collapse. And, and that's really the danger with, with this cryptocurrency. So basically, what is the deal with, with BitConnect? Well, they claim to have a, a trading bot, right? which trades, you know, cryptocurrencies and stuff and will return to, you know, everybody holding BitConnect. So a, a, an interest, right? So like it pays out dividends and you can see how much the, the interest is over on, on this chart over here, in fact, where as you can see, it uh, turns out, you know, about a percent of interest daily, right? Give or take. And not only is that, you know, never seen before type stuff, but there's multiple problems with, with this whole model over here, right? And, you know, some of the concerns range from, for one, what is this trading bot? You know, everything, the whole project is very private and anonymous. You know, the team is completely anonymous. And then there's the concern of if they even do have a trading bot, you know, there's no real proof of it. And even if they do have a training bot, why wouldn't they just keep it? Why wouldn't the developers just keep it for themselves, right? So there's definitely a, a lot of concerns like that around this cryptocurrency. And I think those are definitely valid concerns. If we come over here where they kind of explain their, their volatility software, right, which is their, their trading bot that they claim to have, you can see that they claim, you know, a safe way to earn a high rate of return on your investment without having to undergo a significant amount of risk. That's also, you know, a red flag right there. I mean, that goes against, uh, you know, investing 101, which is higher risk, higher reward, okay? And then they, you know, guaranteed in interest rate, um, accrued daily. All of this is, is just, you know, normally completely impossible. I mean, that's what it comes down to. And another thing that I'd like to mention is with, with any kind of, you know, investment where you're getting an interest rate, Usually the, you know, for example, with stocks, right? If, if there's a, a high dividend, right? What you'll find is as, as you get into the higher dividend range, right? Like a 10% dividend, 15% dividend, 20% dividend, those stocks are never sustainable, right? They, they always come collapsing down when they're at those higher levels of, um, of, you know, dividends. And this is actually, you know, a daily like percent, that's huge, right? That's like 30% a month, over 300% a year. It, it uh, is simply, you know, unfeasible and, and just never seen before. So those are, are clearly red flags to me. And, 
they probably should be for you too. Now, another thing that people like to poke fun at at BitConnect is their referral program, right? And their affi affiliate program, because on their website, they literally have a, a uh, chart explaining their referral program, which is literally in the shape of a, a pyramid, right? And of course, the claims against BitConnect is that um, it's a pyramid scheme and a Ponzi scheme. And I mean, this is definitely a red flag right here, right? Where if you're in at the, the top, right, you get a bigger return on the referral thing. So that's exactly how a, a pyramid scheme works. Now, I mean, it's almost comical, but people are backing this, obviously. And if we come over to the price, right, I mean, it's only been going up with, you know, some pretty minor pullbacks and just new all-time highs uh, constantly, right? So the question is, could this collapse? When would it collapse? And where is it going to be heading in the next couple months? To go through some of the numbers, this is a, a cryptocurrency that's, you know, way up in the ranking, right? The seventh spot cl continuously climbing. You know, it looks like it, it wants to come into the top five. And that's going to be pretty worrisome, right? Because if this thing comes crashing down, it'll be very ugly. And I would be worried to see it even, you know, compete with something like Litecoin, right? Now, you know, circulating supply of 7 million, which is, you know, very tight supply and, you know, good volume on it and stuff like that. But so where do I see this heading in the next couple of months? Well, basically, it's very hard, hard to tell because, like I said, for one, normally, whenever there's some kind of high dividend in, in, in an investment, it usually goes, um, you know, it usually comes downward and this continuously goes up because everybody is pouring money into it. Now, I think that this one looks like, it, you know, based on the chart, it just looks like it'll keep on going. And how high can it go, you know, in the next 6 to 12 months? Since this is a price prediction for, for 2018, um, it seems like, you know, it could go towards 100, you know, $400, you know, um, around something like that pretty, pretty easily, it looks like. Now, is that going to happen? You know, it, it, there's a too much, so much uncertainty, but... It definitely looks like it's going to go into the $300 range, probably move up in you know, 350 and yeah, it could probably start moving towards, you know, $400. So that's pretty concerning to me. And another red flag that I wanted to point out for BitConnect is if you look at how their, you know, uh, interest works here, you basically have to tie up your capital, right? for a certain amount of days before you can withdraw it, which is a really bad sign and a sign of a Ponzi scheme. Um, and you can also see that you, they make it more enticing for you to put bigger amounts of money in with, you know, getting a bonus amount of interest and being able to withdraw your, your capital quicker. So this is yet another uh, really big red flag for BitConnect right here. I'd like to hear your thoughts on BitConnect. You know, do you think it's a scam? Um, what are your thoughts on BitConnect? There's, you know, I've gotten a lot of questions, so I tried to to sort of explain everything around it. And for me personally, you know, like I said, well, I do think that you could probably profit off off this thing in the short term. The risk and and the concerns around it are just a a um, a big no for me, right? And you know, like I explained, the trading bot, the the sketchy referral program, everything just adds up to this not being sustainable, um, you know, that, that's just my opinion. But like I said, let me know your thoughts on this one. I'd be interested to hear those. But otherwise, I thank you for watching. Uh, make sure to leave this video a like. And yeah, um, have a great day.